Well, I'll be a lovely lot. Well, what a disaster last night was. Travelling from Lancashire down to uh, Western Supermare. Uh, I've come working up there this week for the next few weeks. And um, go to the petrol station, fill up some fuel so I need a fuel stop. And I look up and I see the top window on the cab has completely disappeared. So it's either on the M6 or M5 somewhere. Uh, hopefully or in the first lane so it's just blown onto the side into the reservoir somewhere. Uh, but yeah, it's gone. So, uh, Hmm, I don't know how much that's going to cost to get replaced, or... Yeah, so I need to hunt for a new window. Disastrous. But anyway, it can be replaced, it can be fixed, so I need to get a patch on it. I'll get it patched up, and uh, yeah, what a nightmare. Van life for you, eh? Things happen, so anyway, let's get it patched up for a minute. So it's water types, so and the rain gets in, because it's going to start raining at some point this week. So, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll give you a bit of an update on how I get on later on, if I can get a window, or get somewhere I think there's a place in Halifax I believe that do make them on moulds and stuff so I think I'll have to give them a call and see what they and then hopefully it's not expensive expensive uh, but no my luck it'll be into hundreds so yeah anyway I'll give you an update later on so thanks for watching bye for now hi well it's been two weeks since that flint row we did on the window blowing out um, I did loads of research on where I can try to get a new one and uh, basically I, I, I've gone with Eco at Halifax. Um, my dad luckily took me motor home down them last, this week just gone to get it all um, templated so they can make it. They had, they've got the moulds there, they just need to know where all the handles go and stuff like that. So anyway, they've done all that for me and I've got them to measure all the windows to be funny and said just template them all because if ever have any problems in the future I've got all the templates I can just send you and you can make me one, just saves time and whatever. So I thought while we're there they might as well, so they did that for me. Uh, so hopefully I should get the window back this week um, and get it fitted. So obviously I can't go anywhere with her because I don't want to, um, because it's just covered up with plastic sheet at the moment. And I don't want to get moisture in her or anything like that and cost me more hundreds down the line because panels are starting to rot in the outside in and all that sort of stuff. So yeah, so that's what we're waiting for now. So as I'm parked up, I'm just doing a bit of titivating really. I've started to um, wrap all the uh, kitchen doors and cupboard doors because like you can see, everything's just so brown. And uh, I've started down here already on them ones. And uh, so yeah, so that's what I'm doing. So that's what I'm gonna do on the rest of this little vlog. I'm gonna wrap all these up because I can't do anything else because obviously um, I can't move the van really. I can, but I don't want to. I don't want, I don't want to take, take it anywhere and get in it rained in and whatever so yeah once the windows back in we can uh, get on i think the next trip we're going to is uh, at uh, willow fields on the firework display so if you and your guys are going there i'll hopefully see you all there me and the kids uh we're looking forward to that we'll be in the silent one and bit something a bit different this year for fireworks so yeah we're going to there so anyway i'll carry on crack on with this uh, vinyl wrapping and i'll show you how we go on and um yeah see how it goes so i'll see you in a little bit all the doors put all the chop trims on and um, so I'll spin you around and show you what exactly what they look like I think they really look a lot better then now, all nice and wrapped. Just takes a bit all that brown away, just breaks it up. Exactly what I wanted, so happy times. So I'm gonna end it here. I'll uh, I'll check in with you guys later on in the week, hopefully when I get the window back and get that fitted. And uh, yeah, so uh, safe travels if you're going anywhere this week and I'll catch you on the next one. So please don't forget to like and subscribe and comment if you've done this sort of stuff on your van and things like that. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.